of people are horrible people, man. They're still talking about Dana White. They're still talking about Dana White. That literally happened about a year and a half ago, man. My God. Black folk are the worst, man. Y'all are terrible human beings, man. Dana White's wife slapped him. He slapped her back with the same amount of force. Dana White's wife slapped him. He slapped her back with the same amount of force. He didn't punch her. He didn't knock her out. He slapped her with the same amount of force that she slapped him with. You brothers got to stop this hating shit, man, on white people, man. Dana White, what he did was actually a good thing. What he did was actually a good thing. He showed you how to game plan. Showed you the game plan. He showed you the game plan, man. Sons are terrible human beings, man. Y'all are atrocious. I wasn't even trying to go on y'all on this. But y'all are so atrociously terrible and god awful that I even I gotta make this about y'all. You son people are so atrociously terrible and god awful that y'all made me make this segment about y'all. I wasn't even gonna go there with y'all, man. Um, y'all are so horrible and dreadful. That I gotta make this about y'all, man. Um, Dana White. Listen, for 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 all the sons in the back, let me show you something. Because Dana White did nothing wrong. His wife is drunk at the bar, acting like a jackass. We've all been there. Press one. His wife is drunk in public. And she's acting like a buffoon in public. We've all been there where your lady's acting stupid in public. And you're like, look around. You're the only one in here angry. Why are you the only one in the whole? How come every time we go somewhere, you're the only one in the whole building angry? We could go to a football game, 100,000 people, and you're the only person in there angry. So he's dealing with that. He's holding her hands, trying to keep her from hitting him. Look at him. He grabs her arm because he knows she's about to try to hit him. Bam! She slapped the shit out of him, right? She popped his ass, right? <laughs> she popped his ass. Pow! Right? Now, here's the thing, son, man. At this point, Dana White's showing you. Dana White knows all type of martial arts, boxing, and striking. He, Dana White could beat up this average person on the street, right? The average regular dude on the bus on the street or standing in line at the goddamn Walmart, Dana White would make you... Make you um, Cry for your mother. Dana White will make you um, scream for mercy. Right? So she slaps him. Pow! Right here, son, man. You don't knock her unconscious or just start wailing on her like she stole a kilo of crack from you. You slap her back with the same force press one
And some men are so stupid, they can't, they can't, they've been bitching about this for two years when Listen, man, that's why IQ is important, man. That's why I always harp on IQ. That's why I, that's why we talk about IQ here, because you can't ignore it. Press one. Once you ignore IQ, you're being disingenuous. You can't even have a conversation involving some people. If you don't bring IQ into the picture, you can't have a conversation about some people. You're just at that point, you're not qualified to talk about some people. You you gotta, we gonna turn you off. Soon as you start talking about some people and you just all disqualify the IQ and that's just not on the table, turn them off. Turn them off. Cause you can't have that conversation. Man, son men have been whining about this video. For since January of 2023, when it happened, how come Dana White? Da, da, da? She's he he's doing everything he can to stop her from hitting him. She still managed to, to sneak in the slap, and he slaps her back with the same force. He doesn't start wailing on her and stomping her out and dragging her all across the club. Like you would have done, son, man. He slapped her back with the same force. Look, he's holding her arm, trying to stop her from hitting him. He's trying to control. Look, he, he did you see that? Did you see when he put his hand up? Watch this when he puts his hand up because he, he's got battered husband syndrome. Watch this. When she turns around, he puts his hand up. As soon as she turns around, he, he puts his hand up. Think about being a martial arts expert having black belts and you can't even stop your damn wife from smacking you in public. You got all these damn belts and all this damn degrees and, and fighting. Bam! And listen, man, those joints sting, man. Look at his face. That joint stung, man. You ever been slapped by a woman? Press one of you ever been slapped by a woman. Them shit sting, man. Like, pow. Oh, shit, bitch. Especially him. He don't have no... <laughs> he don't have no facial hair, man, to block that shit. He, he shaves, man. So he caught all of that, like... Oh. <laughs> he caught all of that, man. He caught all of that. Pow. Oh, shit. And then he slapped her back with the same force. And then he's, and then all the rest of them, he's trying to stop her from coming back. She, she keeps coming back. He's trying to stop her. Yeah, man, and and all the sun men ignored that. All the sun men that that commented on this ignored that. They ignored everything, the whole um nuance to the situation. Salute to Isla Lampang, man. She says, "Ah, glad conservatives say sons were doing better in the fifties. It won't pace to surpass Gladys economically." <laughs> They blame LBJ and father absence for son decline. What's your take? Were they really doing better back in then? If so, well, I think no, they weren't. We, we discussed that. There were a group of sons that were doing very well. There was a there was a group that was doing very well, but the majority of sons weren't doing well. No, but. They were less annoying. I will say this. 
sons were much less annoying back then. When we go, when we go back and do the old videos, sons spoke with better diction. They were more reasoned. They were more thoughtful in their um in their in in their answers. They had um even though they were, were woke, they were not as annoying. Some people in those old videos we do, we go to, they were they, they were more polished. They had better um their vernacular, their vocabularies were better. They had sense. They had more sense, as you would call it. I will say this. Sons then did have more sense. Now, were they, like, going to overtake white people? No. No. But they had more sense. <laughs> he said you were saying about camera. Yeah, man. Yeah, as I was saying about camera. Um, salute to Paula Sandridge. She says, the news and singing. It's a great day. Yeah, man. I had to drop some Mary J. Blige on y'all, man. You know how it is. Um, so yeah, man, let me get let me go back to Cameron, man. Back to Cameron, man. <laughs> Back to Cameron, man. Cameron Giles, man. <laughs> What's this one says? Oh. Uh. Cameron was fouled for treating at Abby Phillips like this on CNN. As a 48-year-old man, you don't know what you're 